Today I'm playing Harley Davidson 3rd Edition Pinball. Designed by Lonnie D. Ropp and John Borg, and released in 1999 by Stern, Harley rides into Farsight Studios for a digital emulation treatment. The object of Harley Davidson is to complete Milwaukee Multiball by traveling through 16 cities. You ramp up miles by completing any of the targets on the table, so keeping your balls up and long games are necessary for high scores and seeing all the features. You can earn a rider's patch in each city you reach by entering the stoplight. And there's tons of multiball modes, including speedometer multiball, red light multiball, and Harley multiball that you earn by slamming the ball into the miniature model Harley Fat Boy. There's not much in the playfield other than the live ride drop targets and some bumpers on the left, so it's a very fast table. Multiball can be frustrating because it totally disrupts your flow, but when you pull it off, it's quite impressive. The biggest problem with Harley Davidson 3rd Edition is the video mode. It happens way too frequently and takes you out of the game way too long. And running over pedestrians is supposed to be funny, I guess. Other than that, the table is generally repetitive with not much more to do. Mystery Rider. Mystery Rider. There goes that Mystery Rider again. You get to choose a gift each ball, but I don't see why you wouldn't choose next city each time. At least until you get to Milwaukee, which you might never get to because it's very far. And if you get there, it's 80 seconds of unlimited multi-balls to hit the motorcycle. Overall, Harley Davidson 3rd Edition Pinball is good for a few quick shits and giggles. You think that after 3 editions they would have balanced some of the elements better. What do you think? Would you like to see a 4th edition? What tables give you a hard time? Start a dialogue in the comment section and share this video with some friends.